Hi, welcome to Biology uh, 105, uh, the internet course. All right, so my name is Brett Egger. I'll be your instructor for this course. And so on this first video, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to navigate uh, Brightspace, which is brand new to all of us here at SWIC. Uh, and then uh, in the next couple of videos, I'm gonna go over the syllabus, look at McGraw-Hill, and in the last video, I'm gonna show you how to work the lab portion of this course. All right, so let's learn uh, some basics here. All right, so this is the first page that you should see uh, when you get to uh, the Bio 105 uh, course, all right? Uh, so you'll see here, uh, it has Syllabus, McGraw-Hill Connect, which I'll go over in a little bit here. Uh, but what you'll also see here is notes and PowerPoints. So, uh, these are uh, the notes that I'm going to use uh, throughout the semester. So if we just click on that, all right. All right, so now it shows all the notes uh, from chapter one all the way to uh, the last chapter, uh, chapter 19. So when you click on this, uh, it will take you uh, to uh, the notes. So here they are, uh, our chapter one notes. All right. Uh, and then uh, to go back, if you just want to go back to notes, you just have to click on the notes there. Uh, now this will take you back to the notes page. Now what it also does when you go back uh, just a little bit, it shows the content in a different little order. It doesn't show those what they call widgets here. Uh, and so now we can just go to these other areas. So we will go to PowerPoints. Uh, you can see PowerPoints chapter one right there. And so now uh, this is uh, PDF versions of all the PowerPoint slides that I do. Okay, uh, let's go back to uh, content here. All right, so content, table of contents, it's the same thing. Uh, as you can see next here are study guides. Uh, and so I will uh, talk about the study guides here, the lab study guide and study guides for each of the lecture exams, okay? Uh, and so here shows uh, my lecture videos. Uh, so if we click on that, uh, this will uh, take you to uh, my YouTube channel uh, where, you know, if you notice that was one of the slides that I showed in the PowerPoints. And oh, look at me, I, I'm talking here and I shouldn't be talking right now. So we're gonna go ahead and pause that and we'll just go ahead and get rid of that as well. All right, and I'll take you back to this page once again. Go back to the content that lists all the content out here. All right, now, uh, if we go back to the syllabus uh, page, uh, you will see on here, there is a schedule. Uh, I'll come to this a little bit later, uh, but that's a schedule of what we're doing on a weekly to week basis. If we go back to content now, if we slide down here, all right, uh, so we slide all the way down here, uh, this shows uh, what we're doing on each week, all right? So if we just go to the first week, all right, uh, here I've just listed out what I want you to do that week. Now, uh, Sunday is Smart Book that uh, deals with McGraw-Hill, which we'll get to on another video. And then I list uh, what we're doing in lecture and lab that week. Now, I have set this up to follow the same format uh, as my regular 105 class that meets on Tuesday, Thursday. So we're gonna keep the same schedule. So if you look here, you know, I list initially what I want all, what you to do. Now, the reality of this is it's not all due until you have a quiz or a test, okay? So if we go to the next uh, week, all right, so week of 828, uh, you will see Monday, Smart Book Chapter One is due, all right? Uh, but you also see uh, Tuesday is to take the lecture quiz, all right? Now the quiz you have all day to take, and that goes the same for all of the lecture exams, okay? So it opens up at midnight and it closes at midnight. Uh, and so realistically, everything that I said to do in chapter one, even though I listed it on the previous page uh, on a Tuesday, uh, you pretty much have until that day to get it done because then you'll be quizzed on it. Now you can see here, you know, chapter two starts there, but you could have started that earlier because quiz for chapter two starts the next day. Now in chapter two, we're not doing the whole chapter, we're just doing parts of it. Uh, and so that's how we're gonna do this whole semester. Uh, you can go to the next week. I list all the stuff that uh, needs to be done. 
So where do you uh, find the notes? Well, the notes are right there, as I showed before. The PowerPoints are right there. Lecture videos are right there. And if I work my way down here, you can see uh, this is where you can find lecture exams, lab exams, and then quizzes. So if you need to take quiz number one, well, nothing's showing up uh, because quiz one was will only be available on that day that was listed, uh, which, you know, if you come back uh, here on that second week, uh, on that Tuesday, so that would be 829, that's when that quiz uh, will occur, all right? So this is just a short video uh, to show you here uh, all of the, um, how to navigate this and some of the stuff that we're gonna look at uh, with the lecture portion. So, uh, you know, lecture exams are here. Once again, nothing's listed until the day that those exams are due. All right.